So Dad, when we're talking about, in a sense, destiny, we're really, I think for a lot of people, what we're talking about is success, Okay. right? And so, you know, you've been doing art for 45 years or so. Yep. Um, I've been making films for closing in on 10 years now. And, uh, you know, I think success for, for different artists is, is different, but um, I just, for me, I, I meet a lot of different artists, a lot of different people who are creative, and it's, it's almost like an obsession for a lot of them, of like, I just want to be successful, and they all have kind of a different view in mind of what success actually is. And so I'm kind of curious just of your, of your thoughts on, on, you know, what is, what is actually success for an artist? Uh, is it just making money? Is it just, do you know what I mean? Like, yeah, I do. No, I, I really don't think it's that. I mean, we like to think it's that. That's why we're into the arts to make money. But think of all the artists who never made money, and yet they kept on going. Uh, I, I think success, at least in part, has to be the sense of fulfillment when you're working. I think it's a process that you're, that you're in. Um, you know you have product, that's good, you hope it's, hope you do well, everybody wants to be successful. But I found early on in my career that what I thought was success was pretty much, you know, just a vaporous, it was, just wasn't real. And so I really don't, I think we need to redefine success, ask it, it has to do with fulfillment. You know, if I'm not fulfilled in what I'm doing, how can there be success in that? Right. Yeah, and I think it boils down to like, Embracing the journey versus embracing the, you know, going after the destination. Oh, absolutely. You know, I find that some people that, that have success, they wind up becoming kind of commercial representations of themselves. And what happens is because they're successful in a specific thing, and then if people buy that for whatever reason, they feel like they really can't continue to be creative because they have to reproduce that over and over and over again. And all of a sudden, the creative thing dries up, and you find that when that happens, the, the spark it leaves, okay? Right. It just flat out leaves. So, you know, success is a kind of a dodgy thing. It yeah. truly is. And it's tough, because like, I can speak to that for sure, as far as like, um, you know, after three films, my movies all kind of like looked the same. They yeah. had a, a similar yeah. kind of style to them. You got it. And I really like did not want to make that movie again right. as an artist. And yeah. so like I, I, did, I did some things with Holy Ghost that really pushed it away from what from feeling the same way that the other movies right. felt, keeping it in the same kind of genre, but like really pushing it out. Right. And a lot of people didn't like it. Like yeah. they, they, they were kind of like, this feels different. Like, and it was all, it was actually the, the more kind of hardcore fans of my films. Yeah. They were the ones that were kind of like, this doesn't feel right. Yeah. And I'm just trying, you know, but as an artist, you're trying to push people, but there's pushback as well. Right. And I think that's kind of what you're talking about. 